The FBI is now involved in the investigation into a severed leg that was discovered along Cudahy's Lakefront. Now that gruesome discovery linked to a home near 39th in Oklahoma on Milwaukee's south side. The owner arrested. Investigators spent more than 24 hours removing evidence from that duplex, leaving late this afternoon. Megan Lee joining us live now outside the county jail. Megan. Yeah, Shannon, the person of interest identified by investigators in this is behind bars tonight here at the jail. So far, charges have not been filed, and we do know that this is being treated as a homicide. A flurry of activity amid a quiet neighborhood on Milwaukee's south side. I saw a lot of people going in and out of a house, bringing out bags of things. Neighbor Molly Lynn saw investigators going in and out of this duplex all day Friday near 39th in Oklahoma. Definitely worried about whoever that person was and whoever their family was. The man who lives upstairs arrested as part of a homicide investigation connected to a human leg found Tuesday evening along the shoreline at Warnemont Park in Cudahy. Definitely concerning. Um, obviously you never know anything that's really going on in your neighborhood, so definitely concerning. I'm hoping that they find out what else is going on and that it's not a larger issue. Neighbors say the man mostly kept to himself but walked his dogs frequently. Friday afternoon, I found out the pets are now in the care of Madak. I also went to his previous employer. They tell me he was quiet and stopped working there about a year ago. Oh, uh, Shannon, so we uh, don't have all the answers and there's still so many questions. I mean, where is this or who does this leg belong to and why they were called to that home on South 39th Street? So just hoping for more answers, Shannon. Okay. When can we expect to learn more from investigators about the homeowner and its connection to this bizarre case? Well, more information could come in this weekend. However, we can confirm that the person of interest is expected in court on Tuesday. So we definitely can expect some possibly more information on Tuesday. Live in Milwaukee, Megan Lee, TMJ4 News. All right, Megan, thank you.